Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. One of the jokes I just saw in the Guardian newspaper that's uh, a Muslim uh, terrorist <laughs> from a Guanta Guantamo uh, Bay jail. He is uh, suing the president of USA uh, for being anti-Islam. Uh, <laughs> I mean look who's talking. <laughs> a terrorist who want to kill the Christians the Jews, the Hindus, the Buddhas, the atheists, he is, you know, suing Trump for, I mean, you know, this is the amazing thing about democracy. I mean, even this guy have a voice. You know, you know, I have a question for the Muslims. Can you please, as long as you want to sue Trump for his hate to Muslims, can we sue a Prophet Muhammad for saying something like this as an example? Huh? Muhammad's dream is to expel the Christians and the Jews from the Arabian Peninsula and for sure his dream come true for a while but right now his dream is not working because the Arabian Peninsula is full of Christians, Hindus, Jews, you name it it's not working so can we sue your prophet for his hate to the Christians and the Jews just because they are a Christian, I mean, why he want to expel the Christians and Jews? Why? Well, give, give me a reason. Because he loved them, right? Because he is a very nice person. Uh, Trump is a bad person. You see, uh, Trump, he signed uh, uh, like uh, an order that there are six Islamic countries. We should not give them visas for now because they have war. Muhammad, he signed an order saying, kill them wherever you find them, torture them, rape their women, and however, if got lucky, I'm going to expel them. If they got lucky, not me. If they got lucky, I will let them run for their life. I will expel them from the Arabian Peninsula where they are born. You know, the Arabian Peninsula used to have a lot of uh, other religions, you know, including the Nasara, Muhammad, he considered them Christians because he is stupid, including the Jews, including many, many other religions. But right now, the Arabian Peninsula have zero religions except Islam. Arabian Peninsula have zero atheists, you believe it? All of this because Muhammad is a very nice, uh, tolerant person. And a scumbag terrorist is suing President Trump for uh, uh, being anti-Muslims. <laughs> Should we sue Muhammad, uh, brother, Abdul? What about we sue Muhammad for saying that the Muslims have a duty to kill every Jew and if a Jew hide behind a tree or a rock, the tree and the rock will scream and say, Hey, there is a Jew behind me. Come and kill him. Is that a clear evidence that your prophet is a filthy, hateful, racist, uh, fascist, Nazi, Hitler prophet? You see, you Muslims, you love Hitler, and we understand. We understand why. But it's a shame that you want to sue President Trump because he is anti-Muslim. But it's okay for you to be anti-everybody. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. Well, leave your comment and tell me what you think about the stupidity of the world today. That even a prisoner terrorist he can sue the president i mean it, you know usa uh, uh, and the west is suffering from a problem a terrorist who killed a lot of people why even he is still alive you see even in islamic countries a guy like this the punishment for him is very well known but in the west until now they could not find the punishment they are so like they are looking for it you know they give them five stars hotels. They give them nice food. They have health insurance. I don't have one. <laughs> Welcome to the stupid world. I hope things will change in the future and the Western they will stop being stupid because those people they are taking advantage of you because they consider you a fool. And I agree with them. Somehow, many of you are fool. But I think the number of those who they are fool is changing. I think the number is getting better. 
leave your comment down of the video and let me know what do you think about the Abdul suing the President Trump for being anti-Muslim. Let me know, please. Thank you and God bless.